Well, a bowl of soup can go a long way. At least that's how a local nonprofit organization sees it. They're on a mission from your stomach to Uganda. Haiti Clotter has the story. Hands of Action International has a passion for missions and international ministry. Earlier tonight, they held a fundraiser at Evangelical Covenant Church to raise money for their next mission trip in February. We um, felt a calling just to start working in this little village in Uganda, and we made a commitment to stay with them until they didn't need us anymore. And so it's been six years now that we've been going there. The Soup for African Missions will help send the group to Uganda. Jen Anderson is the co-founder of the organization and has made it her life mission to help others. This year, the focus of the mission is community development and medical care. They're also in the process of building a new school. This will help build classrooms for children so they won't get sold into child labor. About 50 guests could choose from Zupa Tuscana or a creamy carrot soup. Emily Nygaard went to Uganda last summer and was able to meet the child she sponsors. I picked out a kid and one thing after another and I got to meet him over there and I actually sponsored two kids um, so I got to meet both of them while I was over there. More than 600 students attend the school and being a sponsor pays tuition and meals for a child. There are still 500 children without a sponsor. It was incredible and I was able to go to their house meet their family and, and uh, get to know them a little bit more. Items from their store, the least of these, also helps fund missions. Here's to fighting poverty, inspiring hope, and changing lives one bowl of soup at a time. In Bemidji, Haiti Clotter, Lakeland News. Nineteen people were a part of the last trip, and eight children saw their sponsors. During that trip, ten more children were sponsored. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.